Herb New Rock, are you ready? 107.9 KPI. Man, what an honor this is. So we're going to be talking here in just a second with Sheriff Mike McIntosh. And, you know, every time, man, I, I get an opportunity or I see, you know, a, an officer, a first responder, a, a, you know, somebody that, you know, that we typically in a lot of ways take for granted, I, I'm always one of those people that goes up and, Hey, man, appreciate what you guys do. Thanks for I was just at that demolition derby or whatever. A couple of other things. Walked through the airport the other day. I just, I'll stop a cop in the middle of the thing. Hey, man, appreciate you guys. Yeah. I'm like, oh, well, well, thank you. A lot of times, because we read stories or you, you, you know, you get pissed off if you get pulled over for speeding. But at the same time, who is really in the wrong? Yeah. They're just doing their job. Even when I got pulled over the other day, I'm like, eh. You're just doing your job, man. It sucks, but, you know, I get it. I understand, and I appreciate you guys. Well, here's an opportunity for us to just, you know, stop in our tracks for a minute and go, hey, man, realizing what they put, you know, they basically write a check for, you know, in that in that bottom line where you write the amount is, it's just blank. It says, whatever you need, my time, my family, my kid, my wife, my own personal well-being, I'll put aside for what they do and what they put on the line for us. Case in point, there was an Adams County Sheriff um, that, uh, you know, that unfortunately uh, lost his life. It's, uh, you know, he was, he, you guys remember, I think we did a cruise back. God, when it, when it first happened, we did one of those. It was back in January. Yeah. Yeah. One of those first cruises uh, down in the Springs for Heath Gum and his family. Um, and now they're doing a really cool event. It's called the Gumball 5K. It's a run and walk. It takes place October 7th, which that's just a couple days away. All right? Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Yeah, man. So let's bring, you know, Sheriff Mike McIntosh on. Uh, first, man, thank you for what you do. And you are so appreciated on this side of coin, more so than you could ever imagine, man, when it comes to what you guys do and and how you guys operate i don't care what anybody says i have i have complete and utter respect for you guys so uh thanks for taking a minute to join us and what a great cause you guys have put together well i just want to yeah thank you guys for for taking the time to uh be with us uh th- this morning and and really for uh the community support that we have had you know i I've been in this business for uh, for 31 years and have never um, have never felt the support that that we feel right now from our community and um, you know when when you walk through some difficult times um, you you truly know where you stand sure. when when you have people come around and really rally around you and support you and and our community has done that um, just in an amazing way and. And we really appreciate everything that, that our community has done for us in, in uh, honoring uh, Deputy Heath Gum. Well, tell us how we can get involved and, you know, just help the cause out. Because, man, b- being able to turn around and, and give you guys the support, I, I really and truly believe you guys deserve. Um, and helping out, you know, the the family of a, of a fallen sheriff. And for you guys... You know, you just never know from stop to stop, from traffic citation to, you know, whatever the call is or wherever somebody flags you down. You guys truly never, ever realize or know what you're walking into uh, in that particular day. Unfortunately for Heath Gum, you know, he, he, you know, there was three deputies killed in a really short time at the beginning of the year. Um, and it's just a tragedy because you guys... Or doing, you know, you're just doing your job and helping protect us. Uh, and when it, something like this, when a tragedy like this unfolds, man, it's, in my opinion, it's our duty, it's our jobs to turn around and be there for you when we can and help you when we can and go an extra mile for you guys and what you do uh, when we're able to. And here's a chance that we're able to. So uh, it's an honor for us as well. So give us the rundown of all things happening on Sunday. <laughs> well, it's called the Gumball, the Gumball 5K, uh, and it will be held at our Adams County Fairgrounds, uh, Riverdale Park. Um, it is a uh, 5K that's obviously 
uh, run to bring awareness and uh, also to raise funds for the, the Gum family, uh, for both uh, Natasha, his wife, and uh, Jim and Becky and, and Lorelei, um, Heath's mom and dad and, and sister, just to help them uh, walk through the process that they're going to be uh, walking through over the course of the next few years. Um, the event takes place at 9755 Henderson Road, and that is uh, uh, kind of almost to Brighton. Uh, it, it's in Henderson, Colorado, but really easy to find. The entire race is right there on the fairgrounds, so we don't have to be out running on the roads. Um, I, w I would tell you that we are, we are so impressed with the support already. We have over 500 participants uh, that are already signed up in this, so we would love to have uh, folks from the community come and join us. There will be uh, folks from the sheriff's office that are obviously running, walking, um, as well as um, some of our uh, equipment uh, that, that we would normally have um, on, on display. Uh, Heath's uh, patrol car will be there. And then uh, South Adams Fire uh, dedicated one of their ladder trucks to Heath with oh, his cool. name on it. It will, it will also be there. So it's going to be a fun day. It's going to be a great day. Uh, we're really looking forward to it. It starts at 9 o'clock, and you can uh, register up until 9 o'clock. Okay. Where, where's a good spot for them to register at? Just at the location? You can register at the location. You can also go to our Facebook page, and it has the information there on our Facebook page. Uh, basically, it's the, the uh, address is gumball5k.itsyourrace.com, uh, kind of a common website for 5Ks for people that are out there uh, running those. But uh, you can find it on our, on our Facebook page uh, with, a, with a link to it that you can go okay. right to it. Man, I don't know about you, bro. I'm not into the whole running thing. Have you ever seen a runner <laughs> smiling? To me, I'm like, no, no. You know when they're smiling when they're done. <laughs> I'm like, hey, the walk part of the run is that's where I'm. That, that's how I'm helping out. Yeah. That walk portion of the program. Yeah. Um, <laughs> you ever seen a happy runner? No. <laughs> well, look, man. It's just uh, it's a it's an absolute honor and privilege. Anytime you guys have anything like that uh, going, we're more than happy to help out. And for sure, you guys, this is an opportunity. If you're not doing anything. Man, this is such a great cause, such a great moment. Because honestly, if you really just take out what, what you see in in television, or you know the the bad, just heat sometimes uh, that these guys will get and realize who's the first person you need, you want, you you, you reach for in any sort of emergency, any you know situation where you need help. Right, it's always these guys and these officers, and we take it so for granted uh, as to what they do and the willingness to put their life on the line. Um, unfortunately, tragedy struck with Officer Heath Gum. Here's an opportunity for us to bring not just a little bit of awareness, but help his family out because he leaves behind, you know, a wife, kid, uh, and just let let the Adams County Sheriff's Department just know, hey man, we got your back. We, you know. We're a part of this community as much as you guys are. You guys are there to police it. We're there to, you know, have your back in situations and scenarios like this when we can uh, and just uh, really honor a great man and, you know, a great service that you guys provide. So, man, if you can go out and be part of it, it would be awesome, just awesome. So thanks again for your time. Thanks again for what you do. Uh, and one more time, if you don't mind, just tell everybody where to go find out info, details, or even a way to contribute uh, via social media. Yeah, thank, thanks again. Um, uh, go to our Facebook page, Adams County Sheriff's Office Facebook page. You can find um, the event is there on the Facebook page. You can register through that. It'll link you right to it. And uh, we're just uh, we're excited for a, for a fun-filled day. There will be food trucks out there. Heath's favorite beer was... Uh, was um, uh, PBRs, so there will be a lot of PBRs out there. <laughs> For those of you that just want to uh, get to the finish line, uh, that's a that's a good incentive to get there. So love to see you guys out there. Thanks so much. Yeah, man, we appreciate it, Mike. You take care, uh, and good luck on Sunday, okay? 
Thank you. All right, my Take man. Take care. And we got all the details on our uh, KBPI Facebook page as well. Good, good, man. Please, please go out and support that. That'd be just fantastic to see you guys out there.